Okay. Bumped into celebrity campaigner, <laughs> Piers Corbyn. And I don't campaign for celebrity. Well, no, I don't think you do. No, you, do. you don't need to. But I'm not too more on there. I know you're not. You're not delighted about the vaccine or, or lockdowns. But let me ask you about Churchill. Do you think he should be cancelled? Should we be ashamed of Winston Churchill? <laughs> That's a very heavy question. It is. A no, no. I remember what my father said to me about Winston Churchill. Because I've read in history, you know, he was a bit of a bastard. He sent the troops against the miners and so on. For years. And my dad said, well, as a war leader, he was what we needed. But after the war, people said, cheer Churchill and vote Labour. And that Labour government was amazing. So I think you have to accept that Churchill was a brilliant war leader and he was also a bastard. Now, you know, in terms of dealing with the working class. So what does that mean in terms of what we should praise or not? Well, I don't know. I mean... I think you have to understand history as it was, not try and rewrite it. And I'm against taking down the statues. I mean, there are all sorts of statues of bad people. I mean, most of them are done something bad. Well, leave them up. You put a plaque underneath saying what they did, of course. But, you know, uh, it's, it's, we have to look at the present. There's bigger dangers ahead than worrying about uh, the legacy of anybody, frankly, and the dangers are the new normal, the new world order, and a dystopia worse than Hitler's Germany, worse than Stalin's Russia. That is ahead unless we stand up to it. And we are out on the street daily standing up to it and preparing people to oppose any new lockdown. And if there is another lockdown, on the day it's announced, we say, take to the streets. Go to, and get set up, stay open unions. Well, pubs, um, shops, businesses are saying, yeah, on the day one of a new lockdown, we will stay open. And we've got little groups in different towns there. You know, Camden Stay Open Union, for example. And little campaigns. Let Woking live. Let London, which is our party, let you know. Let Paul. Well, I want to thank you for your contribution well, to our conversation. Thank you very much. Um, it's all.